If you both want to come at me at once, I'll take you both down. Yeah, we're gonna get into some some dumb and dumber stuff. Palaka, who? Palaka, who? And I was immediately assaulted by him. Loser, loser, self abuser. <laughs> two 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 three 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 four four four. Guacamole. Heather Ray TV. Oh yeah, guacamole. And it's like a battery. It goes from positive down to negative, and then from positive down to negative in this direction. I'm pissed off. I'm pissed off. I'm just concerned. Wait, I'm confused. What's going on here? They're, 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 they're sending emails. Come on, Luna. You can do better than that, man. Maybe wizards. You guys should be looking for those. Reasonable, articulo, to articulable suspicion. Picking out the type of condoms you would like to use. Picking out the tampons they decide to use. I live here! And I'm here for some psychiatric help. Yada, 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 yada. Fake mic real news. Do this, do that. Keys out. <laughs> If you got your license on you real quick, man. My license? Your license? For what? Don't want to see if you're eligible driving this vehicle. Are you a police officer? Hi, and welcome back to the channel where we expose frauditors, Karens, and sovereign citizens. If you're new here, please like and subscribe. You will find tons of content to enjoy. For those interested in criminology, we have a brand new YouTube channel where we go into the minds of the deeply disturbed. Please subscribe. The link will be in the description. In today's video, Casey Camergirl and one of his idiots are impersonating a police officer. They should watch out. They could get in a lot of trouble for that. Enjoy the video. Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. As you have the right to record in here uh -huh. everybody else has their privacy so it's either you leave now or we get the officers over here all righty casey camera boy here back at it again did you miss me mm-hmm no i'm saying let's see these people respect my freedom to record all righty so we got chunky butt over there he's saying the no 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 finger over there let's see what happens so they called the cops on us actually then they got this one here too hey guys Hey, so you guys are allowed to do you guys' stuff, and we just want to make sure you guys were not other people that they thought you guys were. All right? You guys continue doing your, your thing. You guys have a good day. Don't get us wrong, we love California cops, but they are way too tolerant with these frauditors. Okay, uh, do you have an incident, like a business card for the cat, cat number? No, no cat number was pulled. No business card for you. No incident. No business card. What are you gonna do with yourself? Want you guys anywhere on the property? So if you guys go trespassing hey, on the property, quick, man, just don't hold on. Are you, just are don't give listening? directives. Are you gonna listen to me? No, we don't want to hear directives. Okay. Just let you know though. Just you go on the property. We don't want to hear directives. Okay. Thank you though. You're just it's missing. You're just missing. We have to be hostile. Huh? Now this police officer we like a lot. Why? Because I'm on official call. But it's over though. Mm, not over till I say it's over. Your officer just left. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So where did you talk to him? To 22. Cool. Your ego's getting in the way. Go four. Four. Yeah, if you go back on the property, you're getting arrested for trespassing. Alright, when you go on the property too, you will get day. arrested. Dismiss, thank you. You're dismissed, fool. That's a walk of shame. In my opinion, it looks like he's the one that dismissed you guys. Can I help you? You're still in court stuff? Yeah. And, uh, what are you doing right now? Uh, I'm getting into my combat. I don't have to. So, just saying, if you got your license on you real quick, man. My license? Your license? For what? Don't want to see if you're eligible driving this vehicle. Are you a police officer? I'd rather not say at the moment, but. I don't know who Casey Camerboy's new friend is, but he's really trying hard to catch a charge of impersonating a police officer. Like he's asking for IDs, he's refusing to identify. What is he thinking? He wants to meet Furry Potato in jail. Can you show your license real quick? If you're a police officer, you'd have to disclose that. 
Sorry, bud. But you don't want to show your license? I have a license. I'm not going to show it to you. I don't know who you are. But we want to know if you're eligible to driving this vehicle. Well, you can go to the front. You can talk to my commander. Yeah. And then you can get all that information. What's your name? Hector Ramos. Hector Ramos? You want to step in our quick, Hector? Nope. Why not? I don't know who you are. Well, we just want to get to know you. Well, you can go to the front office, ask for the code enforcement Ramos, and I can go in there and talk to you. All right, before you go in there, you mind if we search this vehicle? Oh, you cannot search this vehicle. What's your probable cause? Well, we, we, we may suspect that you have something illegal in there. It smells like marijuana. It oh, does smell like a little bit of marijuana in there. Cool. Go ahead and go to the front. Are you smoking marijuana? Thank you. you mind if we check? Yeah, if you wanted to. Like I said, this guy is really trying to get arrested. While we're at it, why don't we check out Heather Ray TV? Guacamole! Damn, calm down, Asamo. One mention of Heather Guacamole. Ray TV, and he gets all excited. Anyways, let's check it out. I'm good, thanks. I'm good, thanks. Well, I don't want you taking pictures of the people as they're doing their transactions. This is this is classified information. You know? I'm not taking personal information. Well, as long as you're not getting close enough no, to where they're doing that kind of stuff. I don't care what you do out in the lobby. You just can't be up here next to the counter, next to the customer. And that's the thing. The post office employee is asking them to use their reasoning and decency, but they don't have any. So they're not going to listen to him. They're just going to do what they're going to do. Okay. We have not been next. Okay, next I'm just letting you know. Okay. All right. Thank you. Thank and you. And you please name? back up. My name is Jack. What's, What's yours? Show, please? I rather not say. Okay, please back up. Well, you told us to come over here and talk well, to you. Well, yeah. Now please back up. I will. Thank you. Is there? What's the best way to uh, for people to complain on you? Go to www.usps.com. Okay, good. Because you don't say please back up. Do you have, a, bit, do you have right? a business card? You need to treat people with respect and sure. then you get respect back. All right? Thank you. How's that? Please back up. You back up. There you go. I'm back there, 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 you go. In my there, there, there you go. Thank you. There you go. Have a good day. You too. Please back up. We're back up. We backed up. We're going to back up. Thank you. We're going to back up. And then we're going to find out. Protect your information. And then we're going to. Yep, that's up to her to do that. So. Does it look like we're here to steal anyone's information? They don't know you. And what does a scammer looks like? There is no typical look for a scammer. They might look like your everyday citizen. I don't know what you're here to do. You, it's none of your business. Right. You're right. This is a public area. Correct. Thank you for pointing that out. I just want to make sure that the customer's information is protected. Well, that's your job. That's my job. You're correct. Correct. Not hers. Okay. So you protect it. <laughs> That's her job. <laughs> you know what I mean. That's why I'm informer. Have a great day. All right. Now back up. Not just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Now guys, take a look at this. Heather Ray TV just proved the postal employee's point because right now. Her camera is filming the keypad, so someone with bad intentions could easily find out the password if she were to type it in at that time. That's why there shouldn't be cameras too close to where people do transactions. That's why Mr. Marco doesn't eat a whole Yeah. Great job, ma'am. Uh, on the corner over here, sir. Great job to you. Five stars to you guys. But but not to Jack. Not that, Zero stars not, for Jack. Not the backup guy. He is, you, I've seen you treat everybody with a smile and... You know, pleasure to help. Uh, we need uh, you to move up. And, and, and Take uh, Jack's place. Oh yes. Take care. Alright, that's it for these clowns. Anyways guys, thanks for watching. Please remember to call Joey's parole officer and the FBI to let them know about all the threats he's doing. And we'll see you on the next video. Crazy. So here's my number. And call me, baby. I'm absolutely serious. I've never, ever heard anything like that in my life. Who are you filming with watching guys having coffee? I want to see if you respect my rights to record in public. You make no sense right now. How? Because there's no story here. Gods can't be arrested, guys. Listen, listen. Look.
Turn around, face away from me. Oh my god. Sir, if you touch me with that, if you touch me with that, bro. Um, my nationality is Mormish. Come get it. Call the cops. Call Come the cops. Can you call the cops? Come get it. Can you call the cops? Come get it. Can you call the cops? I'm asking it's right here, come get it! Articulate it, articulate it, articulate it, articulate it, articulate it, articulate it. You have a, you have a, a coffee? You're coming with me. Oh. You do not get away with calling me an ass. What are you talking about? Oh, man, I don't know how to read, bro. I don't know how to read, I don't care. I thought y'all was gonna shoot me down. So I said my wife, yo, go open the door real quick. Why the whisk? It's a little bit embarrassing, but I'm not. Actually, the reincarnation of L. Ron Hubbard. All right. Y'all have a good day. I live here.